strong bad. Are you gonna check that email with my boxing gloves? With my boxing gloves. Dear Screaming Yellow Strong Bad, what do you think your funeral will be like? Sincerely yours, Bivendum. Oh man, Addendum, my funeral is going to be off all of the following. The hook, the chain, the charts, the grid, and most importantly, the wagon. First, I'll have to deal with the most difficult decision a newly dead faces. What to do with my stinking, rotten remains? I don't want to just be lying there surrounded by sweet-smelling flowers and sweat-smelling followers. Oh, he looks so peaceful. Shut up, lady. Peaceful is not how I roll. That's why I'm gonna be taxidermied. Nothing sums up my life's achievements quite like my stuffed corpse suplexing a cougar. Ow! It'll be kept in a place of honor for all the world to want to make out with. Body fan, I'm home. Did you find the DNA evidence? Not yet. We are getting close. Well, maybe I'll just preserve myself, fetal pig style, in a mason jar filled with the salty tears of all the heartbroken private school girls that will pine for me. Uh, that way, there'll be something left to reanimate once the zombie uprising cometh. In 2046, on March 31st, at 2.03 p.m. And while I'm a big fan of the classic dun dun da dun dun da dun da dun da dun my funeral dirge would be written and performed by Tarantula! <laughs> I'm not very confident in strong mad or the chief's public speaking abilities. I'll pre-record my own eulogy and have it played back on five boomboxes stacked on top of each other. Greetings, blubbering masses! Pull yourselves together and turn off the snot works. We are gathered here to the hope I'm not recording over anything important. Okay, drop it. Coach Z, Coach Z. One, two, three, four. I said, Coach Z, Coach Z. One, two. Thank you, Strong Bad. And now a reading from the Book of Food, Chapter Sixteen: Pizza Places. Archbog Pizza. Abraham Lincoln's Pizza Cabin. Acupuncture and Pizza. Open late. Free delivery. And now, Strong Dad will perform an interpretive dance based on his brother's life. <laughs> Sorry, everybody. Funeral is over. Not even death can stop me from stopping my leotarded brother prancing around in my honor. But you never got to see my shop all fall. You keep your chappy thong to yourself, mister. Hordes of locusts and famine got nothing on the sight of strong sad dancing interpretively. So in order to spare the world, I guess I can just never die. Okay. Man, I hope the zombies still let me fight on their side. I've got my own tattered jeans and mouthful of grape jelly. Anyone? Zombies? Jelly? Grape jelly? Fall back. The zombies have broken through our defenses. Blarg! We need to activate the doomsday device. Get the leotard. 